Hi everyone, my name is Mike Zucala and I'm the VP of Marketing at Crown Aesthetics and I truly hope this finds you, your families, and staff all healthy and preparing to get back to work. Remote learning is more important today than it's ever been. That's why we're so proud to sponsor this Best Practices video series, which is designed to provide you and your staff highly practical advice in a quick and clear manner as you prepare to get back into your practices and start seeing patients. We hope you find it helpful. Today's best practice comes to us from Angela McDonald, Crown Aesthetic Senior Director of Education and National Accounts. She's been engaged with our award-winning skin pen device since its launch seven years ago. In this episode, Angela shares her expertise and helpful tips for understanding your skin pen device, including how to optimize all of your practice and treatment goals. We hope you find them helpful. Hello, my name is Angela McDonald, and I am the Senior Director of Education and National Accounts for Crown Aesthetics. Today, we will be reviewing Getting Started with Skin Pen Precision, everything you need to know to successfully treat your first patient. When you receive your Skin Pen Precision initial shipment, you will have the Skin Pen Precision device. Within the box, you will have the inductive charger base, the Skin Pen handpiece, and the charging cord. You will also receive the skin pen user manual and the instructions for use, which we will reference throughout this training. Very important, you'll also receive a training cartridge. This is our advanced cartridge unit. This particular training version has no needles and it also does not have the single use lockout feature. This allows your staff to practice multiple times installing the cartridge unit to the skin pen handpiece without risk of triggering the single use lockout feature. Within the skin pen treatment kit, there are four items. The skin pen patient labeling, the Lift HG Glide Gel, the disposable bio sheath, and the skin pen advanced cartridge unit. Within the skin pen treatment kit plus, you will not only receive the four components of the skin pen treatment kit, but also box separately, you'll receive Rescue Calming Complex and also BLT Topical Anesthetic. Here we will discuss charging skin pen precision. The value of inductive charging is the ability to start all patient treatments with a full charge, never having to worry about risk of battery failure mid-procedure. In addition, continuous power is offered by inductive charging, but yet with the convenience and versatility of a cordless design. To charge skin pen precision, please ensure the power cord is firmly placed into the inductive charger base. You will know that you have proper connection when you see the lights illuminate. Here you can see skin pen precision in charging mode. When the device is over 90% charged, you will see that all three LED lights are solid. When all four of the lights that you see here are off, this device is now 100% charged. It takes approximately 14 hours for the device to go to zero to 100% charged. You will notice throughout the day that lights will go on and lights will go off. This is a normal function. The battery is designed to discharge slightly throughout the day and recharge. This will ensure battery life long term. Here we will review applying the skin pen bio sheath. Again, the skin pen bio sheath is one of the components of your skin pen treatment kit. To apply the sheath, slide the skin pen precision handpiece underneath the white portion of the skin pen bio sheath. Push it all the way to the top until the top of the sleeve is firmly against the metal portion. Take the blue outer cover and pull off and then remove the back cover. Finally, remove the adhesive backing and seal the device. You are now ready to install the advanced cartridge unit. Here we will review installing the advanced cartridge unit. To open the advanced cartridge unit in the center of the packaging, pull away the sterile packaging to expose your cartridge unit. Please note that this cartridge unit has a single use lockout feature. So it's very important when we install the cartridge that we do so and lock it into place 
By lifting it even slightly, it can engage the single-use lockout feature. To install the cartridge, first identify the center seam of the device. Then identify the depth arrow with on the cartridge itself. Please note that this cartridge will only seat on this device when that arrow is one quarter turn to the right of that center seam as I'm showing you here. But before that, you must match up the half moon shaft to the half moon post. Turn the cartridge over the device until it seats onto the pin. Again, it's only going to seat onto the pin when that arrow is one quarter turn off of that center seam. Firmly grasp the clear plastic base on the advanced cartridge unit. Please note, during this time, do not grasp the frosted portion. It will disengage that portion of the device. If that were to happen, simply screw it back on. It will be in the correct place. Firmly grasp the clear plastic base at the bottom of the advanced cartridge unit. Give it a firm clockwise turn until it is locked. You will note that the skin pin precision advanced cartridge unit is locked onto the handpiece when the arrow meets the center seam. To remove the bio sheet and advanced cartridge unit without exposing the pin itself to contaminated gloves, first grab the end of the bio sheet to expose the pin being careful not to touch the pin itself with contaminated glove. Then remove one contaminated glove, use the clean hand to grab the skin pin handpiece, pull the bio sheath up over the cartridge, and then grab the cartridge at the clear base and turn it counterclockwise to remove the cartridge. You will see here by removing the cartridge that I have now triggered the single use lockout feature, signified by the little metal piece that is now protruding into the shaft. You may now dispose of the advanced cartridge unit and bio sheath in a sharps container. You have now removed the bio sheath and cartridge without exposing the handpiece itself to contamination.